Oh, hello. I didn't see you come in. Hey, my name's Contract here, and I'm just showing you guys what I was using here on this gameplay in case you were interested. Uh, this map is going to be on Arcaden, and we're playing Kill Confirmed here on Modern Warfare 3. So the point of this video, on one of my videos I said that I was going to do a commentary for you guys on, uh, why did I say every Monday, but unfortunately things happened here where it wouldn't allow me to do that, and now I currently have the time, so I thought of my subscribers and uh, my channel, and I decided to make a commentary video, obviously. So one of the things I wanted to talk about was that's I, that's also one of the it's the things that you say like one of the things I want to talk about it's like why say you're gonna talk about it and why not just literally speak what was on your mind just talk about it. don't say you're gonna talk about it it's like saying oh I'm going to uh, I'm gonna go to college yeah 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 I'm going to college and you never go why just I don't know who knows but one of the things is like, let's say you're going to get a new job and you know you're going to move to that new place, but you still got to work for your older job and yet they don't know that you're leaving. It's, it's kind of, it's kind of rare I and mean, it feels like I want, I don't want to say work at that place does not matter. It just feels like. It's not as, I don't know, again, that's not as not important. Work is obviously very important. How you perform, obviously, is a reflection of your character. But it just feels like any small issues that you might have had with your previous employees, it just it doesn't seem to matter anymore. It feels like, yeah, I'm moving on. I'm coming up in this world. And it just it doesn't feel like it matters, which is a pretty weird feeling if any of you guys ever had to have uh, feel that. It's uh, something I had to get used to, but I guess no big deal. We're all going to go through it eventually, I hope, because I hope you guys will have a job someday. <laughs> and then this, uh, then this gameplay actually was going for the Moab. Not at first. I think once I got a couple kills off of my uh, specialist, I was like, ooh, you know what? Maybe I should uh, go for it. And uh, I said, I had to camp a little bit. So, excuse my gameplay. I'm not the most perfect MLG Pro crazy player here. I'm just, I'm just an average guy. <laughs> and uh yeah yeah so yeah that's something else I wanted to talk about this place feels like it's haunted I started to hear some I don't know if I want to quantify them as noises or voices but I heard something and it started to freak me out a bit and I was just like well, is that is that someone talking or is that just noise? Like I know people I think are above me. But I'm not sure. And as as I started to like pay attention to it more and like kinda really try to like listen to what they were what if they this person what was being said, it just it felt like it was getting louder, but I couldn't understand it. It was just like muffled the whole time. I was just like, what the heck is going on? And then it stopped. And I was like, that is weird. So, I think with this game, I think I was playing with someone. I don't remember who. You're going to have to excuse me. I think it was... Uh, one of my Twitch TV subscribers, I think his name's CC Sniper, and uh, I apologize for 
not knowing your name. And right there, I had scared the crap out of me. I was just like, ah, you're going to kill me with that IMS. And so I just ran. I ran the other way with my tail between my legs. I just was, oh, run, shoot, run. So um, the other thing I've seen up on YouTube a lot lately is all these DayZ videos. I wish the game was more polished and it wasn't didn't have that like uh, lagginess to it where you see a zombie oh I'm fine all of a sudden and he comes at you and you're like oh god and uh, that guy he was coming for me I could see him like all of them are like oh there's a there's the camper in there let's kill him and I wonder what that is about Call of Duty and whenever you see someone on a high kill streak you feel the need to go kill him. And like he comes back, oh thank god he missed. I was I literally like I, I sharted a little bit. If you guys don't know what sharting is, go check out Along Came Polly. Oh man, that movie's hilarious. And I sharted a little bit right there. And of course, like I said, I was again I ran away with my tail tucked between my legs. I think this is about my I only got my third Oh, I was going for the Moab. And uh, I guess we'll see here if we if I get it. And this is a really nice line of sight for this. I've just, just kind of like, hey, I wonder if I can hop on this. And I hopped on it and I was just like, wow, that's a really amazing line of sight that I can just get on. And you got the whole, look at that. Just look at that. You have the whole freaking view. And I was just like, whoa, I'll just mow people down right here as long as they just keep running in. I'll keep shooting him. And of course, you gotta reload behind cover. Of course, why would you? Why wouldn't you? So I did. And oh, I got the Moab! I was so happy. As you can see, my excitement. I called that sucker in right away. I was like, I'll just call it in. Cause I'd seen uh, we were like about five tags away from the game ending, and I just I was like, oh, I got calling, calling, calling. And of course. I had to do the spin. And this was my third mob that I got. And I was super excited. I was going to post uh, offensive combat gameplay, but that just that game's oof, brutal. So I want to thank all my new subscribers for subscribing to my channel and uh, I try to do I'll try to do more videos for you guys. This is something I like doing. And I enjoy doing for everyone and myself. So thank you for watching the video. Uh, like, tell your friends about it. And I will catch you the next time you see my vid.